Hey everyone, Zesh here and welcome to Virtual Virtual Reality 2 Overview. So this is the sequel that I was talking about yesterday that we'll do. I actually just noticed that this is the same developers that did the Andor Presents. I've actually never tried it myself but I've heard very good things about it. So overall this studio seems to be specializing in just narration stuff. At least I hope this small preview that we've done yesterday will help me to understand what will be going on today so fingers crossed. So Virtual Virtual Reality 2 seems to be an action adventure game this time around so a bit of a departure from the prequel where We've been put in various environments but just kinda have a slow paced gameplay with some interactions going on. It was basically like a visual narration experience. This one however seems to be very chaotic in a way that I can't even focus what's going on in the trailer. There's just so much. The storyline is that we're gonna be capturing various avatars that were left off after the metaverse shut down. Very on brand what's going on currently by the way. Still keeping the inception headset thing going on. Personally I'm just praying that everything will be introduced properly to me. Someone that didn't manage to do the whole playthrough of the first game at least yet and that I'm still gonna enjoy it no matter how well I know what happened story wise. It still feels unique on its own just looking at the environments and what even is happening like it kinda pulls you in and makes you wanna play out of sheer curiosity. I wish I would knew more overall but let's go to virtual virtual reality. Let's go I have like no expectations. Jesus, seizure. Okay. okay, prepping procedure for today's last client, number L3M1SH1N3. Hi, uh, hello. Let's begin. Please make sure your headset is snug. Go on. Give it a little tug. Got enough. As your upload text, we're required to read you this welcome. <clears throat> In just a few moments, you will bid farewell to the limits of your body and join in a community of endless possibility, Scottsdale. Help us curate customizable memories for you to share with old and new friends. Tell us about yourself now. Highest level of sentience? Oh, okay. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> I'm impressed. Finish for your larynx. I have no idea. Oh, I, I wouldn't pick that one. We've had a few reports of... Never mind. It's a human. It's up and working. Attach cables to the orifices, not dog ports. This time... <laughs> Got it. For eternity? <sighs> one more coffee? <laughs> what would you like to come home to after a hard day's work? Is this a personality test? I mean... I was told to take tomorrow off. Were you told to take tomorrow off? Mm-hmm. Mic's on. Oh! You're a brave one. Take it slow around the pneumatic tubes. Almost there. Load Galaxy Branding. Scan successful. All preferences registered. Now just sit back, relax, and feel your mind flow up, up, and away. Into Hello? Hi. Hello? There you are. Welcome to Scottsdale. The top rated social metaverse. Your upload is in good hands. My name's Cookie, your personal concierge for your new existence. Right now, you're probably reveling in the freedom of being pure data. Whee! Goodbye, Meat Sack. You have been reborn in a new avatar, a citizen of Scottsdale. What's your name, citizen? Huh? Whoa! What the? Uh, that noise! Oh! Oh my! It looks like you're missing a few things, like, um, speech. You see, whole brain emulation is quite delicate. Don't be alarmed. Botched uploads are quite common recently and covered by your terms of service. I'll simply put in a support request. That's your personal Scott's Pop messaging device. Your first DM. Until we get that voice module fixed, what should I call you? Now scanning. Oh, a bona fide human. Humans are 70% liquid. Juicy. I'll call you Drip. Ready, Drip? Let's head to Scottsdale's main gates for a message from our founders.
We have smooth locomotion but no smooth turning. What's this trend? It happens more often than usual. Hi, my name is Marty. And on behalf of the founding board of Scottsdale, let me be the first to welcome you to your new home. I guarantee you'll have a great time pursuing your interests and dreams while making countless new friends. Now, without further ado, welcome to Scottsdale. I feel like I'm gonna be way more confused than I was in the first game. Yeah. <laughs> what the? Scottsdale Plaza. Isn't it beautiful? Gets me every time I show a new citizen. I am mean, not stop. I do that very often. Well, there was this one time that... Hey, do me a favor and don't go poking around the pneumatic tubes, okay? This is like I would do acid. I feel like this is actually the simulator of it. Our citizens are both native AI and uploaded humans. Working and living together. Not like those dark days of activity. Scottsdale is an egalitarian society. <laughs> so this is like a perception of the metaverse. Still better than the meta one. Run from me, Cookie. Don't pretend you don't hear me. Cookie? Cookie? Cookie, come back here. I see you, Cookie. Hi, Mary. Oh, you must be Cookie's new client. Hi, I'm Mary, Cookie's lover. X? X. We are exes <gasps> and certainly never lovers. Hmm, Snookums. I've been looking for you everywhere. Are you avoiding me? Yes. <clears throat> it's... Um, complicated. Let's move on. Wait, is this the actual new metaverse? <laughs> I like it way more. <laughs> Just her vibe. <laughs> In Scottsdale, you'll meet a variety of different beings. The Vista Deck's a great spot to soak in the gorgeous views of Scottsdale. Or try some croquet. It's the official sport of Scottsdale. What the hell am I blocked? Seriously? Oh my god. Ooh, it's the croquet tournament. Can we play? Huh? Please? Please? Can we? Sure. It's fun. It's a great way to make friends. Hi, buddy. You're gonna join us for some croquet? I'm Lester, and this is... Esther. Hi! You look like you like croquet. Grab your mallet and let's play, buddy. Did I... Give it a swing, buddy. See if you can get the ball through those wickets. They have legs. What Why the... don't you try? Go on. It... This isn't field hockey. The ball... Come on, Use you're interrupting. And Why don't the you ball try? The wickets. Oh Go my on. god. <laughs> Hit the ball through the wicket. Whacking balls through wickets, dodging the demons. It appeals to us, engineers. engineers? You can yeah, score engineers. in the game, but we never are. on me. Me. The we of me are all engineers. What is going on? I like music. Music is very similar to engineering. Yes, I know. I studied melody, harmony, rhythm, dynamics. You cut cookie off. Stop oh, moving. <laughs> music exists on the aesthetic side of the problem solver spectrum, but some of us, as oh my god, <laughs> but no worries, Drip. We're not big talkers, really. Silent types, lovely. Who needs words? Blah. Words, gross. I'm words. <sighs> Where did you learn how to play croquet like that? You're terrible. Hey, don't be mean. That's right. Score that point. Show them how it's done. Stop harassing, Esther. 
Stop controlling, Lester. Are you still talking? Stop talking. Lester, I'm talking. Well, stop. You stop. I'm so saying. annoyed. Break time. Oh, hate it when that happens. How long do they go on break? You remind me of our kids. They were like you. We should stay in touch. We'd love that. No. We'll send you our info. Reach out anytime. Anytime. We should go soon, Drip. There's more to see. Lovely to chat. Lovely to transcend. Stay beautiful. Get weird. Make good choices. Eat healthy. Face the music. Cut cheese. Uh, gross. Ah, oh, finally. Our welcome plaza is constantly evolving based on citizens' desires. To make something, all you have to do is want something. That was one of the most annoying experiences I've had in VR. I was just trapped. Not knowing what to do with annoying people, I know it's elderly couple in this like retirement home and stuff Ooh, like that. We must go to Tina's today. There's even places to dip your toes into the upstreams of temptation and bliss. Oh my god. Okay, I don't know what to do, where to go. I know we just met and all, but I feel like you're gonna learn so much about yourself here. Oh, the food court. <laughs> being seen here is very a la mode. Not being seen here is also very a la mode. What in the hell? Uh. Booby mode, booby mode, booby mode. Booby mode, booby mode, booby mode, booby mode. Oh man. Boop boop. Boop boop. Boop emote. Boop emote. I think I'm glad that I'm not into metaverse. <laughs> if it's gonna look like that, mmm. Go score us that table over there, Drip. I'll do the ordering. What's up with the frame rate right here? Before Boa smashes it, I'll be back with the babies. Here's Tina's tropical delight. Fruit punch and pureed chicken. Yum! Shh! It's starting. Alright, that's it! Ow, 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 ow! As the ancient said, let's make some noise! Ah. <laughs> oh, looks like a fledgling citizen has totted their way to old Tina's. <laughs> <laughs> no need to introduce yourself. Let Scottsdale's database do the work for you. Now scanning. Now scanning. <gasps> We've got ourselves a real single single. <laughs> a maiden to the merge. My fellow citizens, may I introduce Drip, a new authentic human. <laughs> Welcome, Drip. Back in my day, I was a researcher of your kind. Alright, let's gather around and grab our liquids. It's time for... Singles Night! Ow, 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 ow! Whoever's new... Stay in your seat to mingle with as many citizens as possible. Don't like your date? Hit the button and bring out a fresh merge mate. Okay, Scottsdale. Get ready to live out your wildest artificial, organic, intra-intelligence, romance, novel fantasies. And... Start! So, what's your name? Dusty. Sorry. Dusty. I only eat feelings. Nice. I'm unworthy anyway. Bye. <laughs> nope. Are you new? You're new. I'm Boa. Been here 10 years since I uploaded, but I still look young. A little loser. <laughs> Consider yourself unfollowed. Don't upset her. Oh, God. Boa, come back. You've got 10 seconds. 10? Why only 10? I love when you humiliate me. <laughs> Of the day, yes, 
LOL, that's me. I guess every trend expires, even Mimi. What's those personalities? Wow, you're so new and shiny. Almost forgot what that's like. Oh, name's OK Ronnie. Your name is... OK Ronnie. OK? It's an old name from when things had to be more descriptive. Because I'm a veteran, you know? Old school oh, snacks, that's great. Ooh, kind of like an early adopter beta model. You know how it is. It's great. I do. <laughs> I'm a pretty agreeable person. Great. Thank you for a good time. The name's Sweden. Cool. You? Uh, it's called... That's not organic. Look at it. Wow. You... Intense. Rude. Wow. Hot. A real movie. Rainbow. So... <laughs> you have to help me. Are you okay? No. I'm not okay. Do I look okay? Look at me. I'm not okay, okay? All right. Calm down. They're looking for me. Who? The shoes. The shoes are looking for me. I'm in trouble big time. What did you do? What makes you think I did something? That lasted way longer than it needed to. Yeah. <laughs> okay, everyone. That's a wrap up on tonight's single speed dating orama. Congrats to all of you who found a match or matches. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, looking at you, Boa. I know how you do. To those of you that didn't, no worries. There's always next time. Come back again soon, and don't forget to tip your bartender, even the one that's passed out and not helping. <laughs> oh well. We'll have better luck next time. Maybe you just needed a warm up. A way to break the ice. Come on, let's get out of here before Dewey stalks us. Don't worry, newbie. You'll find your merge mate. I'm not single. <laughs> okay, I'm just done. <laughs> I can't sacrifice more time for this overview, nor it is even appropriate to do. Like, obviously, a lot of work went into it, and with just the design, graphics, and stuff, I don't think I've been that confused in pretty much forever in VR. Like the first game I understood what to do and what's going on. This introduction is so long, so haphazard, like it's just not for me. I do love the concept like simulating the metaverse and its stereotypes about people. The game has some issues with invisible walls. This telephone dude is appearing every like half a minute. See, like it's just some polished stuff are not here. I think if I would do weed or acid, I would enjoy it way more because then everything would make sense. I think I'm just made for more simpler things and better explained in the introduction part of the game. But oh well, it is what it is.